Welcome, Aries. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful, positive alignment of energies. So, 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 Aries, 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 I want to say thank you. Please remember to like and share these videos. Aries, it is a wonderful alignment of energies. Um, this month for you, Aries, um, it is um, the month of healing. Okay, so what is happening and what is transpiring? So we see the energy and we're looking at the cross first before we move forward. This healing of any uh, healing energies is coming up. I see eight. Um, 88 is a, your energy vibration in this month. Number 88. Um, whatever is happening and transpiring, there is a lot of healing energies. Um, this month is going to be a healing one for you, Aries. A lot of things are in reverse and people are seeing the truth of what has transpired. Um, a lot of reverse energies. You have the energy of the work that is help that a lot of you are going to be working on healing some sort of an issue and situation that is transpiring. I see you have a taller moment that is coming in. So healing is the name of the game in this month. Um, healing some issues, healing a situation that you have been dealing with. A whole lot of healing is coming in. Healing is taking place between you and other people in this month of September. Then as we look, there is some sort of an emotional situation, a whole lot of emotional situation with friends, um, with partners, with relatives, a whole lot of emotional um, issues that is going on that needs to be healed. Some of you wanted to move forward, but I see a tower moment came down. However, this is happening. I see a tower moment is going to be coming down and it's going to be affecting a Taurus man, whoever this Taurus man is and whatever is transpiring. I see the Taurus man got involved and there is a huge tower moment that is coming down on him. So who is the Taurus in your life? Is he a partner? Is he a friend? Is he a relative? Um, he is in the center. He is coming up as someone some of you could have been having some sort of affair with. Um, and uh, whoever the Taurus man is, there is a huge tower moment that is coming down for him because they're going to be finding out what he has done. Then we see the energy of uh, the devil. So the first week could be very good for you, Aries. Um, that is your energy vibration. But I see a whole lot of emotional imbalance at work or with work. Okay. However, this is coming up, Aries. There's a lot that is transpiring and a lot that is happening. So you got to be on top of your game. However, this is transpiring and this is happening. You got to be on top of your game, Aries, because I see a lot of uh, imbalance, emotional situation, imbalance, emotional situation. So the first week is fire. The second week is water. The third week is air. Then we have water. Then we have fire. So you begin to... Um, the month in, with passion, a whole lot of passion. You begin the month with a whole lot of passion. You end the month with a blast, a boom blast, okay? And you're dealing with issues with your family, dealing with issues with your partner, dealing with relationship issues. Um, but this month is the central. It is the month of healing. So however you look at this, you have to heal a lot of issues with your friends, a lot of issues with your partner and um, um, truths are coming out. Um, the energy of water in the fourth week and then the fire with the energy of the tower coming out in the fifth week. This month has five weeks. Remember, if you want to see the extended of this reading, you have to um, connect via the blue link and uh, set and become a member. You can um, become a member for $1.99. There is uh, three stages, $1.99, $4.99 and... Uh, um, the super extended is $9.99 and you get all the extended readings, all the readings of the month, okay? So, 
let's um see what i do as general as free on youtube there is so much that comes behind the scene because one reading cannot affect and will not affect a lot of people um there is people frequency are very high and different frequency and this is why i advise a lot of you you need to cross watch and you need to go back and look at a month or two before to see what is affecting you if it sometimes my frequency is high so sometimes i will give you a month what what happened in june could be happening now um so you could be too too frequency behind so you can look at go back and look back at the june reading wonderful um images is um here so let's um, take a look at what is happening because we have looked at the cross and we realize that some of you have to be doing some sort of a healing. I see a whole lot of information is coming in and um, you have to be healing um, what is coming up because there's a whole lot is coming up for you guys to be healed. Um, you're dealing with a Pisces Cancer and a Scorpion person, um, a new relationship or emotional experience, invitation um, to some sort of a spiritual event, compassion and friends. And I see a tower moment is coming down on this um, cancer. Um, so there's definitely a tower moment that is coming down on a cancer. Um, a windfall of money could be coming in for some of you. This is true because we're seeing um the 288 so that is about money so um a windfall of money could be coming in it could be money for some people it could be advice for some people or it could be assistance from other a very stressful project a happy change in your career so a lot of you could be changing career in this month also and this is going to be good whatever is happening and transpiring a lot a lot of changes is going to be coming up especially in your materialistic um stability so let's look at the first week the first week we have uh, some sort of emotional situation there could be some affairs or there is um issues that you're working on your relationship because there could be some sort of affairs that is happening and is going on so however this is happening and is transpiring there's some sort of affairs um that is going on and i see that you're going to they're going to be finding out how um this situation displayed and um the affair that has been transpiring um you're working on some issues um emotional issues that you're dealing with and um it can be that you find out that your partner was cheating or you're working to rebuild your relationship however this is coming up then we see the energy of the lovers and with the energy of the lovers i see some emotional problems um a whole lot of conflicts over money um is here for you um ladies and gentlemen a whole lot of emotional uh, imbalance uh, where it has to do with the energy of uh, um money that should have been um is is a whole a fleeted thing with a whole lot of money and it's this happening between you and a family member or you and your partner it could be a sister or a brother whatever um this is and how this is transpiring in your world i see some sort of a problem coming up a financial problem between you and your partner is going to be here in the first week going in the second week then we see um, some of you are dealing with some emotional situation and you're trying to resolve it. Um, it's with a whole lot of family, um, family, um, a whole lot of emotional um, situation and it is, with, it is with family. However, this is happening and transpiring. It's, it has to do with family. A whole lot of uh, instability between you and family that you have to be resolved. Some of you is family and friends. Some of you is family, some of you are friends. Um, but this issue and the situation need to be worked on because this has been going on for quite some time and it really need to be worked on. There, 
um, could have been some sort of a healing that is going to be coming in for some of you and your friends. Whatever that is happening and transpire, I see some of you and your friends are going to be having some sort of a healing. So when we go to the third week, and uh, is some of you working on healing some sort of a relationship and healing some sort of a problems with your friends? So I see a situation where if you're in a relationship with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person, you're going to be finding out about some, um, um, some, um, deceptiveness, some false act and deceptiveness um, that this person and that this person could be cheating on you. So if you are in a relationship, um, you could be falling, um, finding out that this person has been cheating on you. There's a lot of healing that needs to be done. And I see some of you were hoping to receive some sort of a help, but this help is uh, has not come in. Um, I see a lot of you are open um, um, in order, very open to receive this help, but um, the help isn't, uh, isn't here and it hasn't come in. So you have to be aware of that. Then we see truths are coming out. Um, so you young um, people, some sort of information is coming out. Light is been shedding on you, young people, about uh, something to do with a lot of money. And I see... Um, a whole lot of money because this is the seven of um, pentacles and it's in reverse and it has something to do with work. Um, so money could have been missing at the workplace. And I see that you young people, not all of you, it's just um, a handful. The message is here. So I have to give it that a handful of you had some sort of a situation with um, the um, um, some money that was missing at work some sort of a money that was missing at work. And I see you young people, a tall moment is going to be coming down on you. Whether or not you took it, I see they're going to be throwing you under the bus. Uh, so you have to be aware of this because light is going to be shedding on you young people. Then um, what we're seeing here is that a lot of you are open to a lot of things. And uh, um, I see that some of you, um, what is transparent, because this is like, you're opening up and you're hoping for things to be resolute in a very fast way. You're hoping up uh, um, for some sort of resolution. Some of you are going to tie the knot um, because you need financial help. So you're going to be, uh, you know, tying the knot, getting married because you're um, uh, is in need of financial help. So when we go to the fifth week, it is fire and it is removing a Taurus out of your world once and for all. Where but the Taurus is, were you married to the Taurus? Were you having an affair? Were you having a relationship with the Taurus? This Taurus is going to be removed out of your life. Whatever that was transpiring with you and the Taurus, and if the Taurus was stealing from you, um, they're going to be removed out of your life. I see that some of you were having an affair um, and I see um, it was you were having an affair with someone who was connected to a friend group. And this is going to be um, coming out. So be aware of this. So whoever was having an affair with someone in a, in, in, in a group of friends, um, some of you had your eyes on your friend's partner. And I see truth is going to be coming out because... Um, uh, people are going to be picking up on it. So it could have been this person, but it could have been this person who was a friend to, or was married to someone in the group. And some of you were having an affair with that person. I see they're going to be finding out about it and what has transpired. So then we're looking at uh, um, you young people. There is going to be some huge tower moment for you and, and a Aquarian, whoever this Aquarian is, how did you connect with this Aquarian? I see you and this Aquarian is going to be having some huge tower moment where they are shedding light on you and this Aquarian, that you and this Aquarian has collaborated with a Cancer in order um, to do something, and it has to do with a lot of money that you um, all have acquired. For the rest of you, 
be careful there's a lot of jealousy around you so here is um really be careful there is a lot of jealousy some of you who are in a relationship with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person, there is a lot of jealousy that is coming at you. Some of you are going to be finding out some information um, about your partner and, your, um, and the connection between your partner and someone who is either friend, friended or befriended to you. A whole lot of information is going to be coming out about this person. So it is um, going to be an unusual but frightening time um, for you guys. A very unusual but a very frightening time. Um, because some of you, if your sister is a cancer, your sister or your friend is a cancer, I see they're going to be finding out that this person has been taking money on the false pretend. Um, so it's going to be some sort of a a revolution that is going to be coming out about this cancer and a lot is going to be people are going to be finding out a whole lot about this cancer and what has happened and has transpired and truths is going to be here so when we look at the energy of the devil and cheating so a lot of you Aries is going to be finding out um, that your husband or your wife or your partner has cheated on you. Then when we look at work, there is going to be some sort of a towel moment that is coming um, coming down with work for some of you. So be aware of that. Then when we look at the mirror, the mirror is that truth is going to be coming out about some um, infidelity. And um, then we see a marriage is going to be over. Um, because some truth come out about an infidelity and this marriage is going to be over. Then we see the energy of the Seven of Cups and some of you have some sort of an emotional issues that you're dealing with with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person, whoever this person is. Um, I see there is no communication between you and this person. Um, whatever is happening and transpired is absolutely um, no sort of a communication with this person. Um, uh, uh, no communication at all. And I see um, that some of you had your eyes on someone else's partner. I was hoping um, that uh, there could have been some sort of, uh, or you could have had an affair with someone else's. It could have been your friend that you were seeing um, their partner and the truth is coming out. Um, and they're going to be finding out what you have done. Um, then with work, I see some of you um, could be having some slowdown or could be having less hours that is going to be coming up with work. There's no ending. It's just a slowdown and less hours. So then I see um, with um, some of you um, are thinking not to work on a relationship anymore. Um, it's as if... Um, you want to work on this relationship, but um, so much has transpired in this relationship that it's as if you lose an open fate because of so many cheating. This person has been cheating, 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 and you're losing hope. So I see um, when it comes up to work, there's a whole lot of uh, work that some of you could be having. Um, um, it could be very, very um, not that busy. Um, let's say that a whole lot of you have to heal some sort of emotional issues that you're dealing with. Um, you need to heal these issues. A lot of you are going to be finding out that um, your partner, um, some of you are looking at someone else's partner. Um, you have your eyes on someone else's partner, but I don't see that it's going to be happening um, because this person is, partner is going to be finding out what they have done, and um, and it could have been a one night stand, um, but is there is no, it's not going to um be happening. Okay, then we see a situation where a whole lot of communication, um, married people people in relationship is going to be finding out a whole lot of 
infidelity that was going on in their relationship and it's as if because this month is the month of healing it is all going to be coming out and people are going to be finding out that they have been played and i see a whole lot of problems so some of you a marriage needs to work on some of you needs to go to a marriage counselor um in order to save your marriage some sort of a situation where some of you were dealing with the taurus Virgo, or capricorn i see this person is moving forward and is not letting you know this person is just going to be moving out and just disappear out of your life so be aware of this and it's because this person have moved in with someone else so if you were not married to this person it's better not to look for them because they don't want to be found um they're moving forward with the, um um with someone else okay because there was a, always a third party in your relationship um then i see truths i don't know what has transpired with you young ladies you young ladies together with a cancer have collaborated and did some sort of a false deceptive move and i see now um a huge tower moment came down on this person and they are seeing now the truth about what has transpired and i um i don't know what you young people have gotten involved with and if it's your sister i drag you in something but it has to do with a whole lot of money some of you unexpectedly is going to be receiving um some money so that is good wonderful so um you know join us with the extended it's just a dollar 99 and uh um it is better to uh, you know connect via the extended because with the extended you get the the general readings and then the extended and each and every person have their own um sign with the extended so um it's just a dollar 99 per month that is really nothing because you get a lot um a lot to help you move forward you also get a full moon readings because the full moon reading works together with a month reading this is going to be a long month so become a member it's a dollar 99 um um there is a dollar 99 there's 499 and there's 999 but 999 is that you get um love um money just a lot okay so expect some unexpected money is going to be coming in um that is going to be good um business work is going to be slowing down some of you are going to be receiving message about less hours so be aware of that um but this week is that this month is that you're open for healing okay you are open for healing and this healing is going to be coming um in and whoever that has been having some sort of a issues there is some sort of a issues with work or some sort of a jealousy that is going on but it is more of infidelity um by you or your partner that is going to be coming up and this is going to be coming out marriages is going to be on the rocks okay um so um um uh, silent treatment that sort of a thing um so be aware of this so i do love you guys please like and share 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 oopsie daisy share 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 this reading okay likes and share this reading um please um let other people know um and share so that other people can find this reading i love you guys i gotta go namaste